All right, round two for today. Probably the last time you're gonna see snow because tomorrow it's gonna downpour, Sunday it's gonna downpour, and be plus six or 10. So we got the Maverick, she was dead as a doorknob. I think I left the radio on. Looks like we were driving through some fields. Got some Baylor's twine. As you can hear, it's kind of running shitty because the battery is completely dead, but she'll charge itself up. But yeah, we wired it so the radio would stay on. So, you know, when we were down at the campfire, we could listen to music without the machine running. So anyways, we got Hill. Hill, how are you? Oh, I'm good. Good, good, good. Hello, Friday, we got going on. Yeah, here. Friday, Friday, right? So, and then we got the old, the old ski do. So we're gonna take her for one last rip in the snow here down at the, uh, down the track. And you guys will get to hear how amazing it sounds right beside the woods. So Hill's gonna take the road, I'm gonna take the river. And uh, yeah, I don't think the river's blown open yet, but I imagine with that rain coming tomorrow, she's gonna open right up and lift all the ice. Oh yeah, she can, you can see she's starting to get thin there. I'll just skip across her. All right, let's fire this thing up. What a day to not wear snow pants. See, it's still pretty deep here. Ugh. I don't know what the hell the hill's doing over there. She's taking a sweet time. <laughs> I don't think he has a seatbelt on. That's why it's going that speed. <laughs> I don't know if he knows that, but. <laughs> I didn't think that thing went that slow. <laughs> Put your seatbelt on! I'm trying to hand signal him. Put, put your seatbelt on! <laughs> yeah, it definitely doesn't have a seatbelt on. <laughs> All right, he's got her figured out now. Time to tick kick her in turbo gear. Holy, I am sweating right now. I actually went in my boxers yesterday under the uh, snow pants because I was so warm. It was only like minus one. I'm definitely sweating again. Now, is he going to be completely stuck or? There we go. Let her fly. Give her some gas. Stomp on her. <laughs> Is the seatbelt not on? <laughs> I 
No, you're very boring to watch. Is the seatbelt on? Obviously not. It's only going that speed. <laughs> oh, I could watch them all day. Do 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 do. And he's only getting deeper. Okay, I'll go help him. So we have a check engine light on. That's why it's going so slow. Was it that slow going down the road? I couldn't get it past 50. Really? Yeah. That's weird. I wonder if it's because the battery's dead or... I don't know. I just assumed I was in too high a snow, but I guess not, eh? Well, you're getting yourself deeper and deeper, so... The back. snow is deepest over here. It's it's uh. When you said you wanted me on the this side of the field, I you were sitting there, and I was like, oh, well, I guess maybe that's where he wants. Yeah, yeah, but I didn't know you you were this thing it was, was going. It's fine so on slow. the trail over there, but as soon as I get into here, it wasn't yeah. Here. Can you? I don't know. Try and get out of this. I might be able to reverse on the way back. Reverse seems to work better. <laughs> yeah, maybe just try and wait. Don't go too far. Just go over there. Where? I don't know, like a hundred feet over there. That is weird. I've never had a check engine light. <laughs> you gotta follow your tracks. <laughs> You'll figure it out. Uh, just take your seatbelt off and lean out the window. What's that? Just take your seatbelt off and lean out the window. window. Lean out the side to see where you're going. Put your seatbelt on behind you. It was. It was already plugged in. I know, but I'm saying so you can see behind you when you're backing up. You're killing me, Hill. You're going to get a lot of hate for this. <laughs> Hey, it's your vehicle. I don't care. Apparently it doesn't like this much snow. I don't know what's wrong with it. Alright, put your seatbelt on, try and back it out like 20, 20, 30, 40, 50 feet. Yeah, I wonder what it is. There he goes, he's out the window. To the wall! <laughs> oh, this could be an all day event. There he goes. He's back on track. Alright, let's rip the sled. I thought we were going to rip the nuts off the Maverick, but I guess that's not happening.
Oh, holy! I like how the snow is getting uh, a lot thicker and denser with this, this mild heat, cause, uh, or this mild weather. Because, like, it really is so much better. A lot of people are asking, like, how, how do you get it to wheelie so good? Well, one, it's a race that it's super light. Two, it's got giant paddles on it. Three, we loosen the limiter straps underneath. So that that uh, puts the skid down lower. So it gets a lot more grip. But yeah, I'm definitely glad I wore earplugs today. <laughs> I'm sure it sounds sick echoing through the woods too. Do you want to take her for a rip hill? I haven't been on a snowball in or <laughs> snowmobile in years. Well, this one's a lot different. It's just faster, crazier, scarier. Awesome. I mean, you don't have to do what I'm doing. Oh yeah. But you, you can. Sure, I'll take it for a rip. All right. And it's funny, it runs so much better when I'm doing that. Like it was getting super hot when I was just putting around because the snow wasn't getting up there. It was like 140 degrees. But as soon as I started doing wheelies, it just dropped down to 100, so. I wonder what's wrong with the Maverick though. I thought that it was going slow. And then when I was coming through there, I was expecting it to go a lot faster. Like I was stepping on it when I was coming up to you. Yeah. And I had it to the floor and I'm like, I thought it was faster than this, but maybe it's just, I don't know. <laughs> I know, like, oh, he probably just has a seatbelt off, but no, I've never had a check engine light, so. I, I thought the check maybe. engine light was on last time I used it. What's that? I thought the check engine light was on the last time I used it. It shouldn't have been. If it goes fast, it won't be, but. I wonder if it's just because the battery was dead and it was sitting for a while. So, we'll let her sit and think about what it's done over there, and, and then uh, maybe it'll work better. All right, let's get you on the thing. Come on, girl! It's all you! Definitely won't do anything as crazy as I do. Glad I got my custom earplugs though. Game changers. So I can still hear a lot, it just takes the uh, high pitched out of it. <laughs> oh, I can't believe how nice and warm it is today. Now it's gonna pour rain. That sled is so much fun, way more fun than a trail sled. Except that's the only crappy thing, you can't go on a trail with it. I mean, you could, but you won't make it too far. <laughs> I can't believe how deep the snow is here. Perfect for the wheelies. I brought the drone and GoPro too, so we'll set that up and we'll get some Got some cool shots. There you go. 
The wheelie. I do like that trail flap on the back too. It's not as big as the race flap, but uh, it doesn't get jammed up as it normally does. Yeah, this sled does not want to go slow. Like, I feel like the front coming up, and I'm like, no, no, no. <laughs> oh, like you're not gonna flip or anything. No, but... no, but like. Oh yeah, she'll she'll wheel you the whole field. Holy cow! <laughs> I didn't even put it down like completely all the way, and I'm like, the front's lifting, the front's lifting. <laughs> well, we got a good base of snow here, so. Oh, that's so much fun. I know. I'm sweating. Whew. There wasn't one time there where I like, all the way. Oh no. No. You wheeled pretty good when he came across here. I want that video. She's definitely the loudest sled on YouTube, that's for sure. It's what? <laughs> she's definitely one of the loudest sleds on YouTube. <laughs> oh, she's got a race can on. I don't know if it's a prototype race can or what, but it's definitely thanks. loud. Thanks so much, Mr. Mark Freeman 408, for letting me letting me come out. Your I've dreams come true. <laughs> All right, I'm going to throw the GoPro on, then we'll throw the drone up, get a few shots, and get out of here. Are you, are you doing anything on the river today? No, no, it's not open yet. No, I just crossed it, but it, yeah, it's still just slush. Next week, though, she'll be open, ready for ready for service. The only thing is, so in my last sled, it was a 2017. I had deeper footholds, so I jammed rags up in there. So I don't know how that's gonna work on this one. Let's see if I can open this. <laughs> Yeah, so, oh, we got some oil there. Anyways, um, yeah, so the belt's right here, as you can see. So, I don't know, we'll just have to find a piece of styrofoam or something, just to keep the water out. Because as soon as water touches belts, things get very slippery and the track stops spinning. And then you go sinky doodle. You better, uh, you better get on this and entertain your fans, eh? What? Oh, the sled? I don't know how many comments I've read that they don't want to see your friends doing stuff. I like looking at you on it, though. <laughs> <laughs> what, you guys just don't want to stare at it? Just silently? Man, that sun is hot. Oh, I know. Like, I'm, is... I'm taking my coat off for yeah, sure. It's coming off. Huh. Mark is definitely going to be sunburnt. That is for sure. All right, I'll jump back on. Uh, I'll do a GoPro and then we'll stop the drone. Wheelie away.
Is that your first crash with it? <laughs> yeah. I was like, do I keep it going? I'm like, yeah, sure, whatever. <laughs> it's all about the shot, right, Hill? <laughs> Apparently. This is why I should have wore snow pants. <laughs> hey, why don't you why don't you put your pants over your boots? <laughs> I don't want to get into it right now. <laughs> all right. Let's land that drone. You can take her for another rip, then we'll get out of here. Let's see if I can land her on camera. Huh. My fault. <laughs> I tried to land it on the beacon. <laughs> Someone tried to show off. <laughs> yeah. What did you learn? Then I gotta fire it back up now and clear all the snow out of it. <laughs> uh, she'll be fine. It was kind of funny though. It's all about the shot, right? It's all about the shot. I'm sure someone at Scotty will laugh at me. <sighs> Three, two, one. Oh, yeah. All right, I'll catch it like a normal human this time. Oh, man. Good times. Are you having a good day, Hill? Aren't you glad you came out today? Oh, take these damn earplugs out. I feel like I'm just screaming. Oh, screaming and sweating. I'm sweating, yes. Sweating. Profusely. And my nips are hard. Boy, that's that's a nice Carhartt shirt there, Freeman. You like that? I like it because it gets my chest hair out. We should shave a Batman symbol into it. <laughs> I don't have enough for that. <laughs> oh. All right, I'm thinking uh, you take her out for a quick little spin. I should probably check how much gas in it. That's another thing with race sleds. They only hold like... I think 18 liters, 16 or 18. And they burn those liters very fast.
Oh. Ah. Ooh. Try it. was for sure gonna roost me there. That thing just chucks snow so good. It is scorching out today, I love it. <laughs> oh man, definitely getting a sunburn today. Not gonna complain about that. It's too bad we're gonna lose all the snow, but what do you do? Winter can only be so long, especially in Ontario. This is the best winter we've had probably in eight years. How's we get the last of it? The last use of this snow before we're skipping water. fun definitely glad i bought it definitely glad i bought it good uh good youtube investment for sure she's gonna bring in the views she already is so loud she's an earplug sled for sure Just wants to keep going. All right. Oh, this is gonna be fun. You good to go? Got your rocks off? Got my what? You're good? Yeah. <laughs> oh. All right, let's load up. Hopefully the Maverick starts. Hopefully it moves. It'll get out, but. Yeah. Guess I gotta take her in, get that check engine light checked. Check engine, I did, it's still there. <laughs> uh, hey, Dad. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's her all. All right, is this thing gonna move? Or will it even start? Just because it had the dead battery, it was probably sitting there, you know, for a week or two with a dead battery, and it just tripped the uh, 
Trip the old check engine switch. <laughs> You're way off. <laughs> Oh, well, we can go down the <laughs> river and drop it around if you want. Before we put it away. You sure? This will be the last snow of the season. No, I ripped <laughs> up the lawn last time. <laughs> <laughs> okay. All right. We're going to wrap this one up for now. Put the sled away, the Maverick away. That was fun. But say goodbye to the snow. Unless some miracle happens in between. But we're going to be doing more sledding this year. I'm heading out west at some point, I believe. And uh, we're also going to skip the sled, hopefully, every couple of weeks in the summer. Or, you know, obviously as soon as the river's open. So she's going to be a good skipper. I just got to figure out how to uh, close up that little hole there. Because that's where the belt is. And as soon as the belt gets wet, she she gets very slippery and doesn't move. So, you love anyways. It. You love it when she's slippery. Yeah. <laughs> anyways, thank you guys for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. Don't do anything we wouldn't do. Don't do anything Hill wouldn't do. And, uh, yeah, get a haircut. We'll no. See, we'll see you later. Throwing a ponytail. <laughs> <laughs>